it was um, uh, a relief actually when uh, the monetary policy committee uh, gave the signal that rates uh, sh should come down uh, by moving 150 basis points from 18 to 16.5 uh, early this month and uh, as, as you say uh, banks have uh, responded um, we as KCB in fact uh, were very much proactive in this because we dropped our base lending rate from effective 1st of June from 24 to 22 percent so uh, probably two months ahead of the curve on this particular one here so so our base rate today is, is 22. But overall credit is still very expensive right now I remember a few years ago was having this conversation and some were for the idea that it should be regulated above somewhere where the CBR is. MPs have tried this unsuccessfully. Do we, is it likely we might see lending rates below 15% in the next few months? It's hard to say that, uh, Larry, at this particular uh, point because, as I say, market liquidity is a big factor in this whole game. Uh, the whole management of, 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 uh, of government budget also comes into play here you know what is going to happen to to demand from the public sector with regard to to, to money how is central bank going to respond to that uh, demand are we going to see government coming into the market much more to, to, to through treasury bills and bonds or uh, is the market going to uh, basically have sufficient funds if 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 liquidity doesn't dry up then clearly there's going to be a reduction in uh, in interest rates uh, you remember a year ago our base rate was was half what it is today yes. i mean we were at 12 13 and a half percent uh, and so but at that time cbr was six percent or five percent you know uh, etc so you can see that relationship that i mean t-bill rates were seven eight percent you know uh, so, so that is where it's, it's actually difficult to forecast uh, the direction at the moment. But indications are that uh, we, we, we should be moving towards a lower interest rate environment. Kenya is still your primary market because you grew out of here, but you're all over the region right now. I don't know where you see the growth opportunities going forward. The opportunities here are not exhausted. Certainly with uh, Vision 2030, with uh, the county system, through the new constitution, there will be opportunities. In the other countries where we operate, in the five countries, there is still a lot of opportunities again because we are young businesses in those countries uh, and therefore we are looking forward to uh, expanding uh, the, you know, the, the, uh, our bank. Uh, by, by participating more in the sectors that are available there. So looking further ahead, our vision remains to be a Pan-African bank and therefore we shall be exploring what further opportunities exist across the continent.